Good evening, everybody. Can you guys good evening, hear me? teacher. Can you guys hear me? Yes, good evening, teacher. How okay. was your day? <laughs> <laughs> it was good. It was good. It was very relaxing. <laughs> or, or should yeah. I ask how is go going to be your day? Because it just starting right <laughs> yeah exactly no but my <laughs> mm, the day before I was it was before. good <laughs> yes it was good it was good yeah how was your day Heidi uh it was another normal day <laughs> a normal day yeah okay but um it was busy day or or was it, it, it just was, no it, it was a little bit busy because I'm train I'm I'm training someone. Oh you're training someone. Wow, okay, yeah. Yeah, so that's 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 um that's even more responsibility. <laughs> I try to do it the right way. Mm hmm Yeah, of course, of course. Yeah. And are, are they fast learners or? Is it uh, difficult? <laughs> I think she's fast learner because um, uh, she's been working for the bank. So, oh, okay, okay. okay. Uh -huh. So it's not somebody completely new. It's somebody that doesn't mm -hmm. know the system. Exactly. Somebody that, yeah. Okay. Good. Good. I'm glad to hear that. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Um. All right. Very good. Hello, David. How are you? So, so teacher, I really? still uh, see uh, so mm. him. I, I will go to the doctor. Oh, yeah, yeah, because it's been two days now, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. But so, so. Yeah. I I went to work in the morning and the rest of the day I, I rest. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's probably the best thing that you can do. You know, take a, yeah, yeah. Sometimes, sometimes the the body just needs a little bit of rest and, um, you know, just to replenish energy. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, yeah, but definitely go to the doctor. Uh, yes. You know the the. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because um, it, sometimes we try to, um, auto like to to try to uh, give ourselves a medication that we think we need but what ends up happening is that we make things worse because um our we are probably giving our body things that we don't need and in the end uh, our body becomes resistant to that medication yes so yeah, yes. it's worse. <laughs> it's dangerous. Yes, okay. it's dangerous. Yeah, exactly. It becomes dangerous. Yeah. Okay. Hello, Juan Miguel. I see that you're you're driving. Is that correct? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Yeah, I'm driving uh, to home. Okay. Okay, well, I, I thank you for connecting, even though you are on your way. Thank you for your responsibility. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, my day was kind of busy, but uh, trying to complete some files because there is a um, auditoria. I don't know how to say this. Audit, yeah, uh, and they're auditing your your yeah. your workplace. Yeah, my, my area. Okay, mm -hmm. so we 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 were completing some missing files with all the documentation or all the documents that has to be or that have to be in each uh, file, yeah? So <clears throat> we were 
looking for and at the end we found every document that we was we were needing uh, to uh, to give to the people tomorrow yeah i see okay very good that's excellent well um sounds like a busy day yeah kind of <laughs> good but do you, do you prefer days like that I, I, I couldn't hear you, but uh, if I prefer what? Do you prefer days like that? Uh, yeah, um, um, so, so. But it's it's because uh, these kind of days are like uh, mentally, mentally tired. Yeah? Yes. So mm -hmm. because you have to be focus on what the files are you missing uh, and, uh, and try to find them or if you don't have the the files or the documents you have to do at the at the at the time things that uh, could not happen but uh, uh, the the person who is in charge in my area is not uh, it's not there so uh, um, we, we were trying to to solve a kind of jigsaw yeah mm -hmm. I understand. Uh, and, uh, and that's why my day was kind of different yeah mm -hmm. among the other days because the other days are more uh technical support activities and yeah kind of administrative uh, activities but not uh, for example 20 percent administ administrative things and 80 percent uh, technical issues that you have to to solve mm -hmm. in this case what the opposite 80 percent administrative and 20 percent technical issues, uh, technical situations, yeah. Administ administrative. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, yeah. admin. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I, I get it. Yeah, it, and it, yeah, it, it changes that. And when what you say is true, it, it mentally strains you and leaves you exhausted. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I get it. I get it. But you you made it. <laughs> you made well, it. Yeah. At the end, we made it. Yeah. That's good. And, and tomorrow, is it going to be the same? Or are you done with that? Sorry, I, I couldn't understand you at all. Tomorrow? Tomorrow, huh? are you going to uh, be... Continuing with that, or are you done? No, we done. We oh, done good. Now, yeah. Okay, for good. Tomorrow, for tomorrow is only to deliver, entregar, yeah, deliver yeah. the mm -hmm. the papers and wait for uh, the physical physical auditory, maybe. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, that will be in twenty eight. Yeah, uh, the <laughs> physical audit. Uh huh. Okay. All right. Very good. Excellent. Excellent. Very good. All right. I hope everything goes well tomorrow. Then. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Is that is that your your daughter or your son? Uh, it's my son. Ah. Very cute. <laughs> How old is he? Thank you, thank you. He's a five. He's five. Oh, he's a sweetie. <laughs> he's very, very cute. Oh, that's great. Excellent. Okay. Um. Hello, Anna Claudia. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm doing well. Uh, today was I I. I I was in the second day of a, of a, 
I'm sorry. Uh, in my, in the in my company in the account, annually they have like an annual event. Is the name is RKO? Is revenue kickoff? Always they are inviting a, a celebrity or a speech speaker, a high performing person. Last year they invited a, a man. I don't remember the name, but it's a it's an astronaut. He was showing us and, and, and talking about his experience. Of the going Salvadoran to the, the, the Salvadoran no. astronaut? No. Huh? The Salvadoran? No, 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 no. no. The, the event is developed in US, but all of us, oh. we connect from a PK and from a, uh, here in Salvador, US. But last year, no, they interview and they one of the speakers was this man I don't remember his name but it was so amazing how was he was explaining the way how how do you see the air from the moon the beautiful pictures and also there was another uh, speaker Dr. Cindy uh, wow a woman a woman an amazing woman she is known as uh, first lady of sales in the U.S. Wow, what a kind of energy. And this year, uh, the celebrity, there were two, two, but the one that impact myself is, it was, I don't know too much about sports, but this man, uh, his name is, let me tell you that I got his name here. Oh, his name is Dion Sander. He's a coach. Uh, he was he is in the NPL. I don't know. He's performing people. The way how this man was talking, my God, we were all on fire. <laughs> really? I, yeah. A lot of the ideas and things, the way how he thinks uh, is is a revolution, believe me. And and his word is so powerful. My goodness, everybody was like, whoo. Wow. Hey, man. <laughs> he's a it, it, he's a black man he you just can imagine the energy they have when they are talking about what they love to do and one thing he always he, I, I he say many many quotes but today he's one of the the the, the quotes uh, he said that he prefer he always works with dogs and leaders because there is a leader in every dog and there is a dog in every leader. Oh, we were laughing, but at the end he was right. The the point of view that he was explaining and it, it was amazing. Believe me, we learned a lot. And so it was like a vaccine of energy and mindset and good stuff so today um, was the second day uh -huh, it's two days event and we all of us we connect to a meeting link in i don't know it's not zoom it's another program and we are able to uh, do question if you want you can ask to them uh, mm -hmm. it was so amazing it was they also give uh reviews and also provide new information about uh, things or uh, new things coming up with the pro. So it was a it was a great day for me today because these two days we are now supposed to make calls and send emails. Just you need to sit down, watch and learn. And mm -hmm. if there are calls coming in, of course we need to we need to receive them and assist the customer. But it was a an excellent day for me. Oh, good, good. Mm -hmm. Wow, that sounds like a a very uh, was event, very interesting eventful day yeah very yeah wow yeah mm -hmm. that's that sounds interesting mm -hmm. i would i would love to have um well but maybe not meet in person but have the opportunity of listening to an astronaut wow mm -hmm. let's see well oh, it was so amazing everybody we were oh, astonished literally astonished <laughs> yeah no kidding yeah yeah, yeah. Wow. and the, he he said that yes it's real that uh, his body he feels so healthy he felt so healthy since that day until today well last year uh the the his health he mentioned that he became different 
he felt it. And, and it's not a like a, how do you name them when there is a like story that you don't know, like Siwanao and stuff like that. Like a myth and oh yeah, a myth. like a myth. A myth, uh huh. It's not a myth. It is uh, real, but the beautiful picture he was showing uh, were amazing. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Well, you know, actually, uh, when I was um, a teenager, I was yeah about thirteen years old. Mm -hmm. I dreamt of being an um, astronomer. Not an astronaut, but an astronomer. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh, similar. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to study the heavenly bodies. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. But um, of course, as you can imagine, that is a very expensive profession. Expensive okay. profession. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I. The, yeah, it, it was either going to be that I was going to be either very rich <laughs> or <laughs> um, or I had to be extremely smart, <laughs> uh -huh. you know, to get like a scholarship yes. or something. Exactly. To get scholarship. I was about yeah. To yeah, exactly. So, um, yeah. So it was, you know, a Maybe different. Maybe the future teacher. <laughs> Who knows? Yeah. Yeah, you're ready. Right. Who knows? You're right about that. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. You never know. There's, there's always, there's, there's, you yeah. always had to believe. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I would, I, I would never have imagined that I was going to be living in, in the other side yeah, of the yeah. world. So. Exactly. Living your dream. Yeah. Actually, I, I never even knew that this was my dream. <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> yeah so it's uh something yeah something new for me yeah awesome. <laughs> mm -hmm, yeah hello Dora how are you Dora hello. hi hello. hi hi fine yeah Yes. Okay. Good. Good. Um. How was your day? Um. Uh, good. Yeah. This is good. Yes. Okay. Uh, was it uh, a regular day? Busy day? How was How was it? Uh, my day is today is a little relaxed. <laughs> oh, really? Why? I. Uh, Maybe it's for the for uh, uh, the customer no call me much. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. So the the customer usually calls you a lot. Yeah, I, some some days they call me. Uh, one another another another. And, and they said, uh, give me a, a, a lot of documents or, or information, anything. Mm -hmm. But Ooh. today, no. For me, it's better. <laughs> okay, okay. I see. I, I understand. Yeah. Okay, very good, very good. Um, okay, well, um, do you prefer days like that or do you prefer days that are a little more more busy? I prefer more busy. Yeah? Yes, yeah. The, the, the day is so fast. <laughs> yeah, wow. It's interesting, I find it interesting the majority of the people say that. No, they prefer faster days, <laughs> like a busy days. Yeah, yes. yeah. Well, in in a way, I I do understand. Yeah. yeah. Mm, okay. Well, maybe tomorrow I'll be a, a little more busy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully. Okay. Hello, Eliana. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm doing well. And you? 
good. I'm doing good. Can't complain. <laughs> <laughs> yes. How was your day? Well, my day was kind of busy, kind of tired. And really? today we had a, um, I don't know if that's the correct expression, like a country review. Country review? Or oh, when, when? But my boss and all the managers have to present to the, to the regional director, like the results of the month. So I don't know if that's the correct expression, like a country, I don't know, country. Yeah, well, the presentation of the results of the month. How could you say that in one oh, expression? Like, like a, a regional review? Oh, yeah. Or a nation, national review? Yeah, like a national review. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. And yeah, so okay. we they they were connected the whole day. We had lunch until two p.m. So wow. yeah, like kind of late. And then we we back to at three three and thirty. That's yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then we finished at almost at six p.m just in time to, to go home, oh. but yeah, but uh, at the end of the, of the reunion, the comments of the meeting, of the meeting, thank you, uh, mm -hmm. the comments were great, the results oh. were great, and yeah, we are, until now, we are great as a country. Oh. Okay, good, 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 so you had good reviews. Yeah. Okay, Thanks good. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because uh, uh, when when um, the bosses are not happy, <laughs> nah, yeah, <laughs> you can feel it. <laughs> yeah, I, I know. I, I actually, um, I remember that when I was, um, I, I don't know if you guys remember, I was, uh, I was also working as a medical interpreter, and. Um, I would also interpret for um, the uh, the the CEO of the company um, would um, uh, give like a webinar uh, for all of the basically all of the the countries like all of the um, you know high positions of the of the different countries and um he would let us know how the company was doing and um you know like this is you know i, I was just a regular interpreter but because um i i uh, you know i was i was i was interpreting for this for 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 this uh website a uh, we webinar in particular i would find out what was going on with the company and um and sometimes when things were not going well, he was like not very happy at all. And we were like, you know, and, and as an interpreter, I had to like convey that that message, you know, that he was not happy. <laughs> so it was uh, very interesting. But, you know, that's life. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, okay, guys. Well, um, how about if we uh, start by taking attendance. Um, I know that I haven't been able to say hi to everybody, but I do need to get the attendance going. So um, let's do that. Um, okay. All right, so you know who, who's first, right? Hannah Claudia? I'm sorry, present teacher. <laughs> okay. I was like, what happened to her? Okay. Um, I'm here. I'm here. Okay. Okay. Good. Good. Do you good. hear me? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm here. Yeah. I hear you now. <laughs> I'm okay. sorry. It's okay. Uh, what about David? Present teacher. Very good. Okay. Um, Dora? Present. Okay, very good. Uh, Fernando Ernesto? Present. Excellent. 
a Fer Fernando Marvin. Fernando Marvin. Okay. A uh, Francisco Eduardo. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Heidi. Present teacher. Excellent. Um, Ileana. Present teacher. All right, wonderful. Uh, Harvey. Present teacher. Excellent. Jose Marcos. Present. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, yeah, sorry. Okay, very good. Jose Osmin. Jose Osmin, all right. Jose Wilfredo also is not going to be here. Juan Miguel. I'm here, teacher, present. Excellent. Ramon Enrique. Uh, Ramon Enrique. Roberto Luis. Roberto Luis. Roxana Ivette. Okay. Uh, Will, William. William. Suley Maybon. Suley Maybon. Wendy. Present teacher. Okay, wonderful. Are you driving, Wendy? Uh, no teacher, but I go to my house. Oh, okay. Okay, all right. Well, thank you for connecting even from from um, the car or bus. I don't know where you're where you're traveling, but thank you. In the bus. In the bus, okay. Thank you. Thank you for traveling from the bus then. Okay. okay. And Wilfredo Guardado. Okay. All right. All right, guys. Thank you for connecting on time. And um, so yesterday, um, yesterday we were um, we were doing some presentations, and um, and we uh, we finished just exactly with the with the last uh, the last person. Um, the 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 last group better said is so um, it was perfect and today we're going we're actually going to be um, we're we're going to be uh, working uh, in groups but this time we're going to be doing something a little bit different um, in groups we're going to be uh, reading and discussing an article. Okay, um, so I'm going to start uh, by showing you the presentation and you tell me please, if you can see my PowerPoint presentation. Um, you see that? Yes, it's true. Okay, wonderful. So this is the advanced number four, state 12. Date is Thursday, February 16, 2023. Your facilitator is Jessica Guerrero. So um, we're gonna start with this um, article. It's called The Impact of the Internet in Business Communications. So we're gonna start with uh, this first paragraph. And I'm going to need a volunteer to read the paragraph. Hey, teacher. Hey, teacher. Um, okay, Heidi, if you can help us. Okay. The impact of the internet in business communications. In pre-internet days, a business would open a a storefront puts ad in the local paper, join a local networking organization and hope local customers needed what they had to offer. All that changed with the inception of the internet. A business is no longer dependent on its local customer base for its survival. 
it now has a worldwide audience for its goods and services. The internet has changed not only a business customer base, but how a business communicates with employees and finds and manages its competition. Okay. Competition. Competition, yes, very good. And we say employees. Employees. <laughs> employees. Yeah, so the stress is on um on the oh employees. Employees. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much, Heidi. Bravo. Okay, excellent. Um, all right, so let's talk about in this paragraph before anything, let's talk about pronunciation. And maybe if you want, you can write in the chat any vocab any vocabulary that you're finding difficult to pronounce. Or, or that you're not sure how to pronounce. No, nothing? Oh, okay. All right, so we have one word. Um, so the word is, well, can let me, let me, um, circle it. Okay. So yes, this word here, we pronounce it survival, survival. In survival. Any other words that you don't, you're not sure about that you want to ask? Uh, maybe the join between manage and it. How do you pronounce? Mm. Uh, can, do you, can you write in the chat, please? Because I'm not sure which one you mean. Yeah. At the end, the of teacher manage it. Mine manage manages the competition. Oh, the last word? Or ma this one? The, 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 the word, the, the join sound. How do you pronounce oh, those okay. two words? Join one after the other. Okay, manages it. Manages it. Okay. Manages its competition. Manages it. Manages it. Anything else? No, really? Nothing else? Okay. All right, perfect. All right, so let's talk about vocabulary now. You can write in the chat the vocabulary that you don't understand. Beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna wait till everybody writes down the words. Oh, 
Okay, that's it then. Only one word. Okay, perfect. So storefront. Storefront is um in a in a commercial building. Um we may have a many floors in a commercial building um, for one store. So the storefront is usually the room at the bottom of the store that faces the front, uh, faces the, the street that is used um, to like, usually like, like the part of the store um, to show, display the merchandise. Okay, because many times a store may like have many floors and it may function, different floors may function differently. For example, uh, maybe one floor could be like the um, like the storage, like the, the warehouse, right? Another, another floor can be like the administrative area, you know, um, where they manage things like credits and things like that. But the first floor is the one that faces the, the, the street is the one that usually is used to display the, the merchandise so that people can come in and see it. Does that make sense? For example, teacher. Um, okay, so, so it's like a glass. Yes, no. Uh, um, basically the store. Okay, let's let, let okay. Let me let me explain again. Let's say that a store, we have a store, and it has uh many, um, levels. Okay, many levels. Let's say three levels let's say okay the store has three different levels and in the first level of it is it in the the last level it's the warehouse right so they they keep all of the 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 merchandise and stock in the in in, in the top floor the second floor is the administrative area so they have all of the you know um uh all the other people that work in the store, uh, but have administrative positions, right? So like the the manager and um, you know the supervisors, the um, the credit area, but the bottom, the bottom floor is the one that faces the 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 street where people can see the store people can come into the store so this is the place where they display the merchandise they display all of the things that are available in the store okay that's the storefront so that's what people see okay that's the part where they put all of like this they put uh the the ads that their sales and things like that that's a storefront. Does that make sense? Yes, teacher. Yeah. Yes, for me. Yes, teacher. Okay. All right. So basically, a storefront is just the part of the store that you that is available for everybody to see, and that. Uh, where you can see if there are sales, you know what the prices are, things like that. So that's the that's um, the the storefront. Okay. Um, all right. No, oh, actually, I forgot that I need to. Let me. Uh huh. Okay. You okay. Uh, what was the other one? 
Let me try to locate the other one. Because I can see local, but I can't see local paper. Mami, mañana es viernes, hija. Um, hmm. I, I can someone help me see where the local paper is? Ah, it's right after the it. second line, yeah, the second yeah, line of yeah. the paragraph. Yeah, I just saw it. Thank you. Put ads in the local paper. Yeah, yeah. The local paper, when we're talking about the local paper, we're talking about the newspaper. Okay, uh, and especially like the local, so it's not, it's something that people would see um, in the area, right? So um, it, I'm thinking, for example, I, I don't know, like, okay, you know that there are papers that are like national, you know? But then there was papers that are more local, like more of the um, specific area, the specific city where you're living. Yeah, I, I guess in El Salvador, it's not so much because in El Salvador, you know, it's it's such a small country that, you know, it's the same, like basically the same papers, the same newspapers are in all of, in all the country. But when you're talking about a bigger country, just imagine like Mexico. I don't know. Yeah, let's let's take a, talk about Mexico, a bigger country. Um, so the local paper would be the newspaper of the city that the person that the that the business is located where where the business is located. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Anything else? No? No, teacher. Okay, perfect. Okay. Um, all right. So that's the introduction to our uh, um, our article. And here's the second part. And I also need a volunteer to read the second part, please. Who can help me? Me, teacher. Okay. All right. Go for it, Juan Miguel. Okay. Um, the impact of the internet in business communications. With the internet, small business owners have been able to manage their business from anywhere. For example, an owner on a business trip can stay in real time contact with their office through a live chat or messaging apps or a video meeting, sharing important documents with anyone from any location in the world. Let's take a closer look at some of the ways the internet has changed business. Thank you. Thank you very much, Juan Miguel. Okay, very good. All right, same thing we're going to do with this one. I'd like you to write in the chat the uh, vocabulary that you're not sure how to pronounce. First, let's start with the pronunciation. Nothing? Hmm. Okay. Okay, that's a very good word. And I'm saying this is a very good word because there are many words that look similar, so we don't want to confuse it. And this word in particular, we pronounce it through. 
Rue. Rue. Mm -hmm. Okay. Through. Only through, teacher. Through. Mm -hmm. Through. What word is what we said throughout? Is another word? That's another word, yes. Ah, okay. Yes. I remember that there are some words that are kind of similar. Related. Uh, yeah, similar. Through, through, throughout, and through, through, as something through. maybe. Through. Uh -huh. There are three words. Could you write it uh, down in the chat? Mm -hmm. Sure. Please. And try to pronounce it. Okay, so we have. Through, um, out. Through, out, and thorough. Yeah. So the first one oh. is, yeah, so the first one is through, through, the second one is throughout, 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 mm -hmm. and the other one is Thorough, thorough, thorough. Okay. Th through and throughout. Um, in Spanish, I think we could pronounce, we can say that it's the same word, but it has a different meaning. Okay. Through um, means... Uh, like have like via something we can for example here we can say in this in in this context we can say um that it says a uh, can stay in real time real time contact with their office via or via a live chat okay so it's it's it means like the means the way the way that it's done okay and we can say it in Spanish, like a través de, right? Thorough, sorry, sorry, so the second one, um, throughout can also be, um, we can translate in Spanish as um, a través de, but this one is not talking about the means. This one is talking about um, a, like the the time like the distance like for example uh, throughout all my years as a teacher i have come to realize blah blah blah, blah. so throughout a través de mis años como profesora blah 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 right so we're not talking about the means in that case okay it, it implies a, a, a period of time or a, a distance maybe a forest yes you go exactly throughout the forest mm -hmm. exactly Something yeah. Like that. Oh, okay. yeah exactly yeah very good mm -hmm. yes so yeah exactly it implies mostly going through time or going through distance one of those two mm -hmm. okay and thorough, the last one, it means complete and detailed. Complete and detailed. So, for example, I want to check this report, or no, better said, no, no, no. Uh, please be thorough when you write the report. Please be thorough when you write the report, which means please be complete, like do it complete, do a complete job when you do the report and make the report very detailed. 
Okay. Does that help you guys? Does that help you to understand? The last one is not good for me because I, I was looking for uh, an internet and it means Excel. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So like I said, a very detailed and complete. Okay. okay. Escribe, es, por favor, que su repo, eh, que escriba su reporte eh, o oh, ajá, exhaust. Es, oh, con todo fue, detalle. Fue, fue, ajá, con todo detalle. Ajá. O minucioso, por ejemplo. Minucioso. Yeah. Does that make sense, guys? Or. Yes, teacher. Yeah. Yeah, teacher. Thank you. Yes, teacher. Thank you. Okay. Anything else? Any other um, pronunciation questions? The last, the last part, teacher. When you, let's take a close look at some of the of the ways. Uh, we can use this word. It will be another better word in that part, or that is the, a better word to use in, in this context. I think I, I don't know. I seen way is something like a role. It's it the same. It's a role, but but uh, it, I don't know if there is a, a better word of that, but it's okay. Um, I, I I I think it's okay. Yeah, there, I don't see any problem with that word. Um. Yeah, I would say ways is probably the best, the best way <laughs> to <laughs> to to express the idea. It means the manner. It's the the manner that it's done. But we wouldn't be able to say. Let's take a closer look at some of the manners. Um, yeah. So I think ways is 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 the best sense, the best way. Okay. Okay. Okay, all right, uh, let's talk about meaning. Please ask me about the meaning of vocabulary. No, nothing. I have a question about the the, the word "live" or "live." I I listen to that, and sometimes says "live," and sometimes I listen to "live." Mm -hmm. What is the difference? What? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, they are different words depending on the pronunciation and the context. So we can say live uh, when we're talking about um, a verb, right? To to live, I, for example, um, I live in a house, right? Or um, uh, I live in San Vicente, right? So it's a, um, it's, it's a verb, you know, we can use it as a verb. 
uh, but we can also use it as an adjective. And when it's an, and when it's an adjective, we pronounce it live. Okay. Yeah. So um, a live chat means a chat that is done in that moment. Okay. Um, so if, for example, imagine um, you are watching an, an interview on the uh, on the TV and it's a live interview. A live interview means that uh, they are sharing that interview right in that in real time. It's it's happening in that particular moment. So the moment that you're seeing the interview, that interview is happening. So if you went to the studio, you would see the people at that particular moment. Teacher, okay, but so. that is a live interview. <laughs> also a live together. <laughs> Alive. A lot, yeah. Then there's alive if when you have the word together, mm -hmm. uh, which I think you're referring to. She's alive. This word, yeah, yeah. And there is another word. Alive, alive, right? Which means, yeah, uh, when you put it together, al alive means that it's the opposite of dead, right? So, right, right. Many, so uh, many people uh, were found alive after the um after the earthquake um and um the collapsing of of the uh, mm -hmm. of the buildings they were found alive that means that they were they still had they 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 were they still had survived. life in them they survived they were not dead mm -hmm. there, there is a movie of... called like that right alive about these, so. these 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 airplane accidents mm -hmm. that yeah. crashing the Andes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that 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 movie traumatized me. Me too. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I, I, when when Disney uh, make a, a movie from uh, like uh, Aladdin that they do in a uh, Aladdin. Uh, mm -hmm. What is what is the word for for that movie? We had a, we we do it was a cartoon and then it was in the, animation. The, uh, it, it was animation, but then, then Aladdin was with the real person, the real people with a different character because, uh, for example, Will Smith was the the, the genius. Oh, I see. And, what was the name for that kind of movie? They they say some some name for for the movies. Is it we we are doing uh, the live version or something like that? Yeah, the live. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. If we could say a live version, uh, which is opposite to the animation version. Okay. Right. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, and like I said, in that case, so basically, to for you to understand, in general terms, if we use that word as a verb, we pronounce it live. If you're using it as an adjective, it's going to be pronounced live. Okay. Okay. Great, thank you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Anything else? Any other vocabulary that you want to ask the meaning? No? Okay. No. All right. Perfect. So what we're going to do is, since it says here, let's take a closer look at some of the ways the internet has changed business. What I'm going to do is I'm going to be, um, I'm going to uh, be dividing the class into three groups. Okay. By the way, I need to see uh, your cameras on. So, because uh, right now I do not see Jose Marcos, Fernando Ernesto, Wendy, eh, and Francisco Eduardo. 
So if you guys can turn on the your cameras, I want to make sure that also you are here and that you are able to participate so I can assign you to the group. So Wendy cannot participate. Francisco Eduardo cannot participate. Jose Marcos. No. Okay. All right. Okay, so I'm going to be dividing the class into three groups. Let me make the group first, and then I'll explain what you're going to be doing. Okay, just give me a second, guys. Okay, all right. Okay, so what we're going to do is the following. Um, I'm going to give you one slide that is going to contain two points each. So in total, there are gonna be six points of how the how uh, the internet has affected businesses or yeah, the, the, the impact of the internet with businesses. Two points. I'm gonna read the information, look at any vocabulary that you don't understand, try to figure it out, and you're gonna make notes about it because later what I'm gonna do is I'm going to switch you around so that you're gonna have a new um a new what a new group where you're gonna have uh group members from different groups and you're gonna be explaining the PowerPoint, the information from the PowerPoint uh, to your group. Does that make sense? Yeah. So we have to take notes about the the vocabulary, the new vocabulary that we found or or take no, notes about the information. The information. The information. Oh, okay. Yeah, about the information. Yeah. Because they're going to be explaining that information to uh to other people in a new group. Okay. Okay. But of course, in the group that I'm going to put you in right now, you're going to have to find out the information, uh, uh, or better, so the vocabulary uh, uh, that you don't understand, so, the, so that you are able to understand and explain. Okay. Teacher. Okay. Does that make sense? No? Yes. Okay, perfect. So I will be assigning, uh, I will be sending you to the new groups and I will be coming over to is uh, to deliver the PowerPoint that you're gonna, or the, the information you're gonna be looking at. Okay, so just be um, a little bit, um, what's the word, patient while I get there, okay? All right. Um, okay. Uh, are the instructions clear or do you need yes, you do. more instructions? Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. So we're going to open the rooms right now. I'm going to give you 15 minutes. Okay.
Okay, guys. Um, so I'm going to try to see if I can send this through the chat. Hopefully it works. Yeah, it should work. Can you guys see it? Yes. Okay, wonderful. All right. Uh, oh, I will, and I will enable um, you guys to be able to present, okay? So. Hello, Dora. Hello, Roberto. Francisco Eduardo, are you there? Hello, teacher. Yes. I, I hear teacher. Okay. Um, did you get an invitation to join a group? Uh, sorry, teacher. Did you, get an did you get an invitation to join a group? I don't see. I, I think the uh, I uh, I okay. join uh, in the Delta. Okay, so I'll send you right now. Okay, I'll send you to to one of the groups. Okay. Sure. Thank you. Okay, here we go, guys. Um, I'm going to be sharing your PowerPoint. So, um, and uh, you were able to, and I have already enabled um, the, the sharing of screens. So you should be able to share. Okay, there you are. Okay, you see it? Guys, do you see it? Yes. Okay, perfect. All right, so I will um, see you later. Okay. Hi, guys. Uh, I am uh, waiting for the slide. Here it's coming. It's coming. Uh, how many okay. times from from Turkey to El Salvador? <laughs> in, in, in in the channel. <laughs> yes. Can you imagine? Like yes. it's amazing, huh? Like how the inter yeah, this is this is like not possible without the internet. Really, just imagine how quickly things get, you know, passed on. Yeah. Okay, so you guys see it, right? Yes. Yeah? Okay, perfect. The bag of the internet in business communication yeah. for the other business, yeah. business automation. You can Those also, yeah, you can also um, share the slide. The screen? Yeah, this in screen. Okay, so if you want, you can, you can share. Mm -hmm. Okay, the impact of the internet in business communications. Yes. Collaborating with other business, it was simplifying working with other businesses and professionals, internet based events by webinars, major knowledge of collaborating with people all over the world. As you see, as logging onto a website, business automation, a major driven driver.
Is it just me or are you guys in mute? No, we are in mute. We are reading the. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, what you guys can do maybe is, um, uh, you know, um, uh, read it together. Uh, oh. Yeah, like uh, take turns reading. That could okay. be something. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Mm. Dora was here, was here like a minute ago, but I think she's gone. Yes, I hear. Ah, oh, you're here? Okay. Uh -huh. okay. I see. Oh, yeah. I can uh -huh. see you now. Yes. Okay. So we can read the, the information if you want. Uh, also to practice, right? And we can take notes of some maybe new vocabulary that we don't know or we don't understand. And then we can um, make like the other part of the activity that is take notes to, to explain to the other classmates. Okay. Um, who I... wants to be first? On reading, I'll, I'll be the first. Okay. The impact of the internet in business communications, ability to communicate. A business's ability to communicate with its employees, customers, vendors, and associates changed dramatically when the internet yielded new communications tools. Email and instant messaging, and now messaging apps like WhatsApp and Messenger have changed the face of business communications. Should I continue? Mm, do you want to, to continue? Okay. Remote and even work. Driving to a great extent by COVID-19. Many businesses are now offering the option for their employees to work from home online often using office equipment provided by the company, either full-time or part of the quit. This process allows a business to cut its overhead costs by needing less office space and using less in utilities for daily operation. Okay. Mm -hmm. I found I found some there are I found six points there. Mm -hmm, exactly. exactly. Well for me the the first point is dramatic exchange to compare tools uh, with con employees, customer, and vendors. If nowadays, it is, uh, I can use a uh, email, WhatsApp, Messenger for communication. It is, uh, the other is uh, uh, the employees can't Work for home for their home their homes, uh, full time or part of the week. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, teacher, how do you pronounce that word? Uh, yielded. Where? Uh, uh, the third line, when the internet yielded new communication. Oh, yielded, yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay, and the first line in the second paragraph, paragraph is remote and hybrid or hybrid? Hybrid. Hybrid, mm -hmm. okay, thank you. In this case, teacher, the word after remote and hybrid work is driven. The pronunciation in this context, driven, right? Or yeah. driven. 
Driven. Driven. Always driven. Always. Driven. Always. Driven. Driven to the key. Mm -hmm. Yield, yielded is like a, another way to, to express yielded could be give. Is that a question? Yeah. Oh, um, dramatically, yeah. Yeah. Kind of yeah. Give. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, exactly. Change the face of things. Communication is the mode and how we work driven to the constant cycle of activity. This equipment provided by the company, either full time or part of space, using utilities for daily. Sun, or maybe around the world, yeah, but uh, if you do this kind of situation more focused in a, in a geographic zone, maybe are the most quantity or the more quantity of results you, you will get. Yeah, this is related with digital advertising. And at the end, it says that you have many, um, many tools or strategies in order to, to build your, your presence or, or build your market's presence or shop presence. I guess and this, obviously, this is like the Facebook advertisement, right? Yeah, kind of. Or the Google Ads that mm. you, mm. for example, you visit some, some website and uh, there are many spaces. <laughs> Many spaces through the through the web page, mm -hmm. so they are offering you, for example, a a Big Mac for 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 example six dollars, yeah, mm -hmm. and you have many many ads, mm -hmm. uh, and it kind of complicated to explain, mm -hmm. but for example, if you visit uh, Wendy's, uh, but even you don't buy anything, but if you were near from the Wendy's, <laughs> yeah, you will get some of this advertising. Yeah, so some of these ads. So uh, obviously they are related with the user preferences. Yeah, not, not in the device or not in the, yeah, not only in the device, uh, but also with, his tastes, what uh, he or she wants, uh, and I don't know how to say this, como su gusto particulares, his particular tastes, or something like this, yeah. I think. Personal tastes. Personal tastes, thank you. Mm -hmm. I remember we had a, a, a classmate last last course, uh, and he, I remember he told me once that he paid like uh, one hundred dollars for these ads on on Facebook, and it's so effective uh, because he no longer pays any advertisement for newspaper or any written thing or radio. And, and don't think in local channels too expensive and doesn't have the effect that he's looking for because he's I remember he's he was telling me that Facebook also uh, like uh, categorize people per hours 
uh, who is watching from range of ages. And if he's looking at target, for example, people from 35 years and more than that, Fabio will make the arrangement for logarithms and I don't know why, but she's, he said that he noted the difference. If you can, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you, you're right, Ana Claudia. If you know what you're doing, you could get uh, a big revenue. Mm. Yeah. Obviously, you have to be prepared before Edwin. we. It was Erwin. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh -huh. Erwin, I, I think. Mm -hmm. But you have to, to be prepared before. Uh, before this kind of advertising yeah Launching. for example mm -hmm. for example what is your uh, schedule <laughs> yeah what's your schedule but uh -huh. uh, the main the main objective of this is uh, to be to, or to have maybe a uh, have recognize which is your final client yeah in order to attack this kind of 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 niche niche niche. I don't know how to say this in English. Niche, niche. Uh huh. Niche. And obviously, at the end, uh, get more clients. Or if you want to convert the the um the old clients in uh recurrent ones or recurrent clients, yeah. Mm -hmm. We we call them targeted clients. Targeted, uh huh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know if Wendy or uh, Jose have a better way to do the 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 task that the automation can do cannot do. Yes. There is, yes, there is important. Eh? And uh, uh, well, this is the range from basic accounting practice to customer service. And in, in that range, uh, we can find all kinds of companies and in every company can uh, do this task of automation. Uh, the, a good example is when you call, you, you call and there are a, a system or or now the companies are uh, creating an, an uh, something like, uh, how was the name of this app that uh, put the music that you as Alexia, something like that? Alexa. Alexa, Alexa, yeah. Alexa okay. But uh, there are now the companies have a, a virtual assistant and uh, they chat with you. Yes. <laughs> uh -huh, virtual assistant. They are uh, uh, in the chat with you. Uh, but uh, from now, there are only specific questions. And uh, the virtual assistant tells you, I don't understand your question. You write a lot. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, the the company and the people avoid that that uh, people uh, that are mad about you. And you are not the owner of the company, but you receive the, <laughs> the complaints of the people, the angry people, and uh, if they. If there is a virtual assistant, they can shoot out all, all of them. <laughs> <laughs> no problem, okay. But uh, in, in all of that, the uh, fields are uh, automation, the, the business area. It, that's the tendency to automation or to automate the, the, these companies and bigger companies and, and small companies too. Are you guys ready? Uh, so, so, teacher. Okay. So, so, we um, are 
Do you need more time? I think we are okay. Okay. We know, yes. Okay. All right. Perfect. Um, I will bring you to the main room then. Okay, you you have this this image, yes? You have this information. Okay. Yes. So, uh, are you guys ready? Almost, teacher. Almost. Okay. Almost. Okay. I'll give you one more minute. Okay. Okay, teacher. Maybe the new communication tools accessible to the public, like the public in because. Uh, they can see the product or or your service uh, in social media, for example. Are you guys ready? Yes, teacher. Yeah. Yes. All right, perfect. I'll see you guys in about a minute. We'll see each other in the main room. Okay. Alan. Um, reminder is faster and also through the remote or hybrid, hybrid work you can connect anywhere and everywhere hmm. uh, business recommendation Teams, team, work teams can connect easily. Um, so. Okay. I'm just going to repeat like the six ideas that, uh -huh. I, that I have, I think that. Okay. <laughs> okay, number one, accessibility to the information 24 seven. It means anywhere, anytime. Um, number two, new communication tools that are accessible to the public in general. Mm -hmm. uh, number three, improve the relationship between companies, customers. Uh, number four, reduce costs, for example, overhead costs. To the comp for companies. Number five, information sharing and finder is faster. And number six, with the remote or and hybrid work, you can connect anywhere, anytime, in real time or pre-recording. Mm -hmm. uh, can you repeat number four, please? Reduce cost. For example, overhead, overhead costs. Oh, Ileana, just be careful with the word. Um, it's public. Oh yeah, public. Yes. Mm -hmm. To the public, public like a A, yes. right? Public. Yes. Ha, 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 ha. Public. Okay. Yeah. Public. Okay. Five, Eliana. Sorry. Ah, don't worry. A information sharing and finder is faster. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sharing and. Sharing and find information finding, sharing right? finder is faster. Is okay. Are we back? Sorry, it's but it's back. Okay. All right. So what we're gonna do, um, we're now going to assign the new groups so that um so that you guys can have um, one member of each group and you guys can explain, okay? 
So, yeah, let's see if we can. Just be patient with me while I figure this one out. Okay. All right, so I think I have everybody. Um, and I'm gonna give you about 10 minutes to share. Okay, here we go. Francisco Eduardo? Hi, teacher. Hi. Hi, it yeah, that's Barbara. what I was going to tell you. Um, that there were there were three groups. So you, in theory, you're supposed to have three. Um, uh, three people in your group, but right now, um, the third person, which is Wendy, uh, she disconnected uh for some reason. I guess she was, um, probably on her way to home or something like that. And so, as soon as she connects again, I will send her to your group. Okay. 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 Did you? All right. Thank you. Okay, Roxana. Um, so, or need to learn other ways to to make the marketing, and that uh, opens the door to the to the digital uh, marketing, right? Uh, also, but, uh, that concept was talking about the importance of making service service to the customer uh, all those forms you need to fill after a service yeah. or when you ask for delivery food they ask you how was your order did you like this this and that the feedback they uh, they are getting from us as customer that information gives to the companies like uh Another idea, other ways to expand uh, their strategies. That is what I understood for the marketing to uh, wider areas. Then the other concept was digital advertising. Uh, we understood in, in the group that the digital advertisement is not only uh, pay for radio or newspapers 
or television. Uh, now there are other options. Nowadays there are other options like the advertisements in social media. So when you visit YouTube or Facebook or any web page, always there is a space uh, could be below or above. Always there are like tiny, tiny lines uh, with uh, advertisement for whatever you want. And we had a, a, a colleague, I don't know if you remember in the last course, that he mentioned that uh, he pays, he was paying for advertisements for one week in Facebook. And he noticed the difference uh, because Facebook makes the, the advertisement uh, thing, uh, but depending on targets by hour, algorithms and stuff like that. And he was paying like around six, $100 per week. So for him, it was an investment that it worth it. So the digital advertisement is all those uh, advertisements and ads that we see on the on the web page or Facebook. And, and we need to watch them like for 30 seconds, right? Then we need to wait 30 seconds to pass. Those were the two the two uh, concepts. One is marketing to a wider area and the other uh, digital advertising. And the uh, same. Okay. okay, okay. Perfect. The same? So, the same? The same, yes. Mm -hmm. All okay, of us so. have the same? No, no. No? Me, I have um, another, another like, you have a different one? Let me check. Let, let me check. Okay, go ahead. This is mine. Nah, the, the, no, it's different because it's marketing oh. to a wider area mm -hmm. and the using of digital advertising. Ah, and, and, yes, you're different. right. You're right. I, I, I get yeah. confused. <laughs> Okay. okay. So, I don't know. In my case, was the ability to communicate and remote and hybrid work. The ability to community or communicate. We were discussing about the all the tools that we have for communicate communicating, like chats, social media, uh, business uh, chat, like maybe Google uh, Google Chat, Teams that. The, the companies use for communicating uh, with every work, yep, uh, worker. And we were discussing about the, the emails, the instant messaging, uh, all the communicator tools, and the remote and hybrid work. Uh, as we know, after COVID-19, uh, many, many business, offering the option for their employees to work from home online. And uh, such as uh, maybe a form that uh, the client or the customer needs to fill in your website. Uh, you can monitor the activity, uh, the, the customer activity through your website. Yeah, and uh, it, lets you uh it let you uh know uh what uh what kind or not not what kind uh, what else uh, you have to do in order to to expand or to grow your business yeah uh, in the other paragraph or the other topic that uh, the lecture was was about uh, it was about digital advertising yeah and it's related with obviously marketing to a wider area through the internet yeah uh, nowadays the 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 businesses have many ways have other many ways to advertise or to to go and capture 
the customer's attention. Yeah, for example, if you are searching over the internet and you go to a website, you have many spaces, many blank spaces when uh, this kind of advertising is uh, showing, yeah, or are showing. And many of them are related with your personal tastes, yeah? Because obviously, um, before you get an advertise, uh, the company or the business has, ha, the business has, uh, how to say this, uh, has implemented yeah many uh follow and try to uh, consolidate the main idea and the second topic is automation uh, business automation is uh, important because uh, when a company try to um, to the task more um, is in, in an easily form or in an easily way, they try to uh, autom como automatize, automation, automating the different um, different process. Uh, imagine when we are talking about a bank. Right now, you can create a bank account in your bank, in your online bank, bank, bank online, bank online. And if you remember in the past, we needed to visit a bank to create a bank account. But right now you can uh, use your bank online and create a different product. So the company is trying to uh, looking for a, a easy way to transform the normal operation for another faster than the than the normal right now, and it's important because uh, they can save money because uh, maybe they don't uh, hire a lot of persons or people in the in the company, and the other hand, save time because. Uh, you don't need to uh, pay extra time, for example, for uh, different employees. If you can uh, keep um, automation tasks in a bank online. Okay. Please. That is, I don't know if Wendy. Are there? Are you there, Wendy? I think she's not. <laughs> Wendy, are you there? Wendy? Mm, not Carl, sorry. Yeah, well, I don't. Then... Uh, what I can do is I'll share the information with you. The... Oh, yeah, we can read the information and share ideas. Yeah, I'll, I'll share the, the the information from the PowerPoint that of the group that Wendy was in. So you guys can know what it's about. Okay, there it is, girls. You can see it? Yeah. Okay, perfect. I can share the screen, Roxana. Yeah. 
servicios profesionales te damos, te ofrecemos más, Thais. Ok, ok. Yeah. Interesting. José Marcos, what is your information? Okay, uh, my information is about marketing to wider area. So the marketing to wider area means that uh, some business, like small business, need to reach other markets. So they need to perform or do some things like surveys, questionnaire, feedback forms uh, on a website. For example, they can use Google Forms to uh, make like a survey of their web pages and the experience of the clients in their web pages. So that's uh, how they can um, measure or monitor the needs of their customers uh, to reach more customers and to uh, cover all, all their needs. So this concept is... Um, highly related with the digital advertisement because uh, if they want to reach uh, more clients, uh, they have to do some advertising. And you know, uh, the advertisements like uh, have an, an fence or, or something like that in, in, the, in the street is very, very expensive. So they need to adapt with the new times. Uh, so they have to include the digital advertising in their widget well. So they have tools like um, ads in web websites, uh, in apps, in apps, in apps, in, in mobile apps. Um, another example is the um, ads in Facebook and in social media. So, Facebook, Instagram, and another uh, social media, social media, social, uh, social platform, social application. Uh, and another example is the search engine optimization. What is this? It is when um, in like a website or or business is well publicized or well placed in the in the searching in Google, for example, if you search, uh, I, okay, I want someone who can repair um, shoes. Okay. Uh, based on the on the location of the business and uh, based on the on the field of the industry or the business, uh, the um, the searching in the in Google will appear in that order. If you invest more in the search engine optimization, the more will be, the more you will be placed. Well, you will well placed. So you will be placed on the top. So if you search uh, uh, something in internet, you tend to click on the first. The first one, yes. So. Okay. Okay. Just because. Uh, after group, I say that back to the uh, the business, but in the um, social media is other information, but it's similar this. Okay. And what about you, Jose? Um, actually, I'm joining. Sorry. Okay. But I'm really here. <laughs> yeah. Yes. I, I think uh, that we could go away maybe to a forest or something like this without internet. And for us, it... It, it would be it, great. We would have fun. Yeah, it would be great. But for other generations, they it try to kill, kill themselves. Okay. Because yeah. yeah, it's too boring. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> and I wonder when we get old, how is it going to be? Yeah. 
Um, there is a a new topic, a, a new topic mm -hmm. like uh, artificial intelligence. Yeah, mm -hmm. mm. that it's uh, very it it's it, it uh, will be very popular nowadays. Yes, and obviously there are computers. Yeah, with some kind of programming. And for example, if you want to know uh, how to solve um, maybe a, a, a programming situation, you can ask for them and they, um, they deliver you the right code that you have to use. Yeah, so maybe the, the programmer man could be kind of obsolete too. Wow. Yeah. Uh -huh. And the, the dinosaurs with their professions, uh -huh. yeah, they were they were created by artificial intelligence. Okay. And uh, uh, yeah, yeah. And you there's an app. Yeah, there is a website, I don't remember the name. But you can describe in that website how do you want your avatar, kind of avatar. Yeah, for example, I, I, I'm a, in your case, teacher. I'm a teacher who is in his theories and use earphones and teaches some English lessons. So the artificial intelligence creates your avatar and you can uh, share with people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's kind of in a couple of seconds, not in a minute, in a, in, in seconds, yeah. I, I, I saw a video of a guy that once was uh, saying like he could create uh, like, like uh, a picture of whatever he wanted by just telling the application, okay, I want, I want um, to see a, you know, like a, a frog uh, jumping, uh, you know, and from one a pond to another pond uh, with, a, you know, the a rainbow in the background. And then he would give him lots of different scenarios. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, this kind of artificial intelligence, it's uh, trying to use with the... Uh, um, with chats, for example, with WhatsApp bots, yeah. In order to you ask for whatever you want, and they mm -hmm. try to answer you with with an answer related what you are asking for. Mm -hmm. Not the traditional one, no, no, not the traditional bots that okay, your option one is, uh, or if if you put number one, the option is. Uh, to make oh, some, oh, mm -hmm, it's it's mm -hmm. it's beyond. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's beyond. Mm -hmm. uh, Interesting. Kind, uh, kind of that you are texting from for for uh, almost like if we were texting us between us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's amazing. Well, I'm going to um, bring you guys back to the main room. Okay. Okay, so I see, I think I have the majority of you guys back here. So I'm just going to quickly take attendance. Ana Claudia. 
Gracias, teacher. David. Present, teacher. Dora. Dora. Present. Fernando Ernesto. Present. Eh, Fernando Marvin. Fernando Marvin. No. Eh, Francisco. Present teacher. Okay. Heidi. Present teacher. Uh, Ileana. Present teacher. Harvin. Present teacher. Jose Marcos. Present. Uh, Jose Osmin. Present teacher. Uh, Jose Wilfredo. Uh, Juan Miguel. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Okay, okay wonderful. Uh, Ramon Enrique. Ramon Enrique. Okay, Roberto Luis. Roberto Luis. Roxana Yvette. Okay. Um, William and uh, Alexander. Soleima Yvonne. Wendy Patricia. Present teacher. And Wilfredo Guardado. Okay, guys, so that's going to be all for today. Um, and I guess according to um, the, the list, um, it would be um, Jose Wilfredo. But we, Jose Wilfredo is not here. So um, if Jose was mean, if you want, you can stay today since we couldn't um, do it yesterday. Okay. Sure. Okay. All right. Okay. So that's it, guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you. Thank Good you. You're welcome. Thank you, everybody. Bye. 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 Hello, how are you? I'm doing great, teacher. Thanks for asking. Good, good, good. So um today um you you finished work late um or yes, actually I went out, so that's why I was not in the hall meeting. Oh, okay. You went out. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I see. And um, uh, how are you? Are you managing with the platform? Uh, actually, I remember that I made the, the second part. I am about to finish the the midterm. Oh, you're about to finish your midterm. Yes. Oh, wonderful. Okay, okay. Um, any problems? Any questions that you have? Uh, for now, no. So I was like, I can say that, that everything is clear. Oh, just for one, I, I don't remember exactly the part that actually I I complete everything, but at the end, so it says around 20. The score was 20. And actually for all of them, so it has to be 25. But I don't know so if like a problem with the platform, but it's just one. Part, but I don't remember exactly which one. Can you show me from your device? Actually, I, I'm now here with uh with the cell phone. Let me let me get the, the computer. Okay, because you can also do it from the cell phone. You can also share. Okay, but let me see here okay. on the computer. I have okay. it here. So okay, no problem.
I'm checking now. Okay. Can you can you get into the Zoom meeting um from the computer? Yes. Okay. I can. That way you, that way you can share in the straight so I could I could see it. So it's sure what Anything I can help you with? Um, I haven't your problem. Sorry. That's okay. It's okay. But I'll let, let me. Ah, the ones that is the issue is the 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 part two. So that is actually the ones that says do to and thanks, and also through, by because. Due to because I have everything selected correctly, but it says here 20, 25, but it's not getting the, the full score. Okay, can you can you get into the Zoom meeting from the, yeah. the computer? And... Yeah, it was like updating. So, so. Oh, it's updating, okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. because that way I can see the exercise directly and what what number did you say it was? The second part. Well, uh, I'm getting now. So here, this four eight eight six two three nine. Okay, so this is okay. So this is uh two point two or two point five. Is two point two. Two point two. Yes. Okay. Okay. There's so there's twenty points. Mm -hmm. Two point two. There's twenty points. But sorry, but I'm, I I'm about to to get into the Zoom meeting so on the computer. No way. So this. Okay, here we go. Okay, I just got access here. And okay. let me show you. Uh, 
escucha, sí, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let me share. Let me share the screen. Okay. Here. So it said here twenty twenty five. I don't know. So if there is something wrong in this part. Okay. Um. Go up. In this part. Part two it says. Up. Up. Up more. Oh, this is the midterm. Okay, hold mm -hmm. on. Okay, hold on. Let me just check something out. So this is part two. Midterm part two. Okay, let me just check that. Don't 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 stop sharing. Okay, let me just. Okay, sure. I'm going to be checking from my my end. So I can compare. Okay, so mm. can I see can I see your answers again? Yes. Uh, it says tent true. Cause due to and everything is mm -hmm. everything is marked like mm -hmm. with a green check. Okay, so if you notice, mm -hmm. there's really only four answers. Yes. <laughs> yeah, there's only four yes. answers. So actually five. There, there's five questions but only four answers uh -huh. this is it ah yes yeah, so that is a, like an issue right uh -huh, yeah so instead I think of it's... number five mm -hmm. five mm -hmm. it's, it's just that okay if go, go a little bit up yes okay right there stop stop for a moment uh-huh okay. here is yeah yeah, exactly. So there, number four is there. Um, um, in a scare, hold on, just give me a moment. Is it in a scare okay. scenario? How much could be motivate monitored? Yeah, Let, yeah, but there's still a problem there. So I'm going to report it because um, I think that's supposed to be separated because in reality, those two exercises have different answers. Mm -hmm. Yes. So I'm going to report it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll report it. And thank you. Thank you. Thank you for letting me know. So I'm going to oh. report that, um, and we'll we'll see how that. But I don't think there should be a very much problem in the end for you. Let me just mm -hmm. check how that works out at this moment. Okay. Um, okay. But but yeah, you you got on all of them correct. So let me just report that. Okay. Okay. Sure. Mm -hmm. And and thank you for letting me know. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah. Okay. Anything else I can help you out with? Oh, no. So everything's okay. Thanks. Okay. Okay. Good, good, good. 
All right. Uh, remember, anything that you are having problems with, any questions that you have, you can always write in the chat um, or write to, re to me directly. Okay? Okay, sure, I will. So thanks. Okay. Appreciate You're that. Welcome. You're welcome. All right. Okay, well, in that case, I'm going to let you... Um, sleep take a rest um, it's <laughs> yeah. late okay so um yeah i i um i will see you tomorrow okay sure thanks okay. so much you're welcome take care thanks you too bye-bye bye-bye